Over the last year, the pandemic has taken a toll on the mental health of many people. And as part of our new mission, let's talk about it. We are breaking through the stigma of mental health. New Center Maine's Jackie Mundry looks into the mental health challenges that older adults are facing and a bill co-sponsored by Senator Susan Collins that would help provide mental health resources to that population. I think we're we're just starting to see it, but we have no idea in some ways what what other needs are going to lie underneath that. Megan Walton is the CEO of the Southern Maine Agency on Aging. She says the pandemic has been hard on a lot of the people who use the agency's resources and that because of the isolation many seniors are facing, some of the resources are in high demand. Increased our phone pop phone pal program dramatically because folks were looking for somebody to just talk to. Just last week, Senator Susan Collins co-sponsored a bill that would provide funding for mental health services for older Americans. The Medicare program will only reimburse for counseling and other services that are provided by certain health care providers, but not others. But if the bill is passed, it will allow more mental health providers to get reimbursed for services. Therefore, more people will be able to use those services. Walton says she has seen many seniors decline quickly this year. Decline is everything from mental health, so folks who have dementia or maybe had, you know, seen signs of dementia, it has gotten worse. Walton adds that not all seniors are experiencing the same mental health challenges, but she and her team are continuing to support older Mainers any way they can. Jackie Mundry, New Center, Maine.